Assalamu alaikum. Hello and welcome to Gurukul Online Learning Network. Today, your instructor Sheikh Mahadi, Finance and Banking, Chapter 6, Long Term Finance. So, let's take a concept of long term finance. What's a long term finance? The accumulation and management of a fund required for a business firm to acquire fixed asset or to invest in a long term project is known as long term financing. Short term financing ranges between 1 to 5 years long term uh, long term investment is basically termed to 1 to uh, 5 to 10 years that's a that's a long term finance and short term finance is 5 to 10 so accumulation and management of fund required for a business firm to acquire fixed asset management accumulation management of fund a fund that a, a company or an industry is taking for an asset to develop or to, to run their business for a very long amount of time to invest in a long term project is called a long term financing as we said from 5 to 10 years ranging from 5 to 10 years start with a long term financing period so say for instance someone wants someone is a owner of a certain company and now wants to expand his business by setting up another unit for that he will he will most likely be required to buy land building factory premises other uh, capital buying machineries so for starting any kinds of company business development whatever we name it people most certainly needs land if it's a very huge company industry or a management company it will obviously need land uh, factories and machineries machineries for if it's an industry or a manufacturing company machineries is a must so factory premises land and machineries are the three main uh, three main top may, three main topics are the major issues that had to be held for those who provide utility to generate revenue for a long period of time so finance that he needs to develop a financing plan that will accumulate fund for a long period so he will need to accumulate or just to take or gather or sum up his whole amount of money that will last for a huge amount of time or huge amount of period financing that is called a long term financing now the main question is what the time frame the long term financing is there are different options in this regard some cases it is told financing plan lasting more than five years is called long term financing so as i said short term ranges from one to five years only but long term financing ranges from five to ten years five to ten years is basically taken or more than five if it's five it's short term it exceeds five it's a long term finance to be called as so but some of the scholars possess different opinions that starting uh, starting any financing that has a time frame of 7 to 15 years is called a long term financing so as we said long term financing short term financing some say it's more than 5 years like 5 years one day it's called a long term financing if it's 5 years that's short term financing but some people say some scholars some individuals or professors or researchers whoever they might be on a business trip or business fielding they say time frame of 7 to 15 is called a long term financing sometimes it may exceed the time of 10 to 15 years that is normally known as long term financing uh, but some of the scholars view let me just explain to you long term debt is for which payment is not due to the current year it's said by the famous lj gilman it's a scholar he's also a scholar for suppose cb gupta he's an indian he told he told long term finance is generally needed for a period of 10 years or more so as i said 10 years or more some scholars say 7 to 15 as some say 10 or more according to inside to 10 uh, 10 or something suppose for example jj hampton financing with maturity from 7 to 15 years is called long term financing as we just told you 7 to 15 years time range is called long term financing and some consider it more than 5 years different scholars possess different kinds of opinions about what are called the long term financing so from the above discussion we can say the short uh, long term financing which runs for a very huge amount of time or a very long period of time is mainly basically taken from 7 to 15 years but the long term financing does have some features so let's talk about the features the nature accumulation of fund uses repayments and the uses of other factors of long term financing to some extent different from others it can be different it can be not it is different from others in short term financing people get different kinds of uh, advantages in short term and long term financing they get different kinds of advantages say so, uh, advantages disadvantages both alters from same to each other so long term financing duration in long term financing the purchasing asset is fixed and long term that is basically longer for a period of time longer for a period of time, that means exceeding 5 to 7 years up to 10 to 15 years generally the duration would be 7 to 15 in most of the cases source of fund basically the fund is made up to two ways one is long-term debt and the other one is equity financing what is one which one is called long-term debt 
लॉन्ग टर्म डेट इज कॉल्ड टेकन फ्रॉम द बैंक डिरेक्ट लोन टेकन फ्रॉम द बैंक दैट इज कॉल्ड अ लॉन्ग टर्म डेट एंड वट विच वन इज इक्विटी फाइनेंसिंग इक्विटी फाइनेंसिंग इज यू शो योर अमाउंट ऑफ लैंड मशीनरीज फैक्ट्रीज वट एवर एसेट्स यू हैव एंड देन बाई शोइंग दस पेइंग दो एज अ मॉर्गेज यू टेक लोन फ्रॉम द बैंक दिज आर द टू डिफरेंट वेज ऑफ सोर्सिंग योर फाइनेंसिंग बट डिटेल मोड्स ऑन फाइनेंसिंग कैन बी डिस्कस लेटर ऑन सम टाइम ऑब्जेक्टिव लॉन्ग टर्म फंड इज यूज फॉर लॉन्ग टर्म पर्पोजेस लाइक परचेज इन्वेस्टमेंट इन लैंड बिल्डिंग एंड मशीनरीज प्रोड्यूसिंग वट एवर गोज इन साइड द फैक्ट्री और इन साइड द मैनेजमेंट कंपनी दोज आर नॉट लॉन्ग टर्म दोज आर एक्सेसिवली शॉर्ट अमाउंट लाइक सपोज फॉर एग्जाम्पल रॉ मेटेरियल्स यू कैन नॉट कीप दम फॉर अ वेरी लॉन्ग अमाउंट ऑफ टाइम दोज आर नॉट शॉर्ट टर्म दोज आर नॉट लॉन्ग टर्म दोज आर कुड बी जस्ट सेट करेंट एक्सपेंसिस और करेंट एसेट्स और करेंट लाइबिलिटीज दो are taken in instantly and taken out on an instant but long term is different in case of building lands and machineries size of fund size of fund is usually greater than other sources of finance long term financing has the most biggest size of fund greater than other sources other form of finances cost of financing the cost of long term financing is typically lower than others because cost is one thing and financing that money is other thing short term financing is a very short amount of time in 5 years in business years 5 years is very less but in normal years 5 years could be seen a huge a whole lot that's why as it is a long term its costs are very much low than the short term financing tax advantages the interest on debt and preferred stock dividend are deductible for tax purposes so by using the modes of financing taxes advantages can be achieved through long term financing rather than taken by the short term finances maturity long term finance advantages to the borrowers for the long term maturity these types of credit eliminate the danger of rapidly recurring maturity of the principal so what does that mean recurring maturity of the principal recurring maturity maturity for a short term business is only 5 years but for a long term business is exceeds to 5 15 years sometimes it exceeds 15 sometimes 16 17 a certain cannot be said a particularly certainly we just cannot say so it is advantage to borrowers they borrowed it for a huge amount of time they get a huge amount of time to pay that money back that's why the credit eliminates the danger of maturity that before the time ends one won't be able to pay the payment that does not happen it's a very rare case when people do not usually tend to give out all the money they had taken those are very rare cases in case of long term financing security long term debts are uh, debts and preferred stock are backed by security like mortgages and asset securitization as i said mortgage when long term financing finances funds are taken people take mortgage they give the lands and buildings or machineries papers to the bank and in, uh, in account of that they take out money so that's called a mortgage mortgage that falls into a security section though common stock does not have require any kind of security but requires extensively regulative compliances so what does that mean common stock common stock means share stock share could be said as a common stock those do not require these kinds of security but they do need to be regularly complied uh, which that's why they said expense uh, sorry extensive regular compliances claim on assets any long term financing instrument that have a residual claim on asset in case of liquidation what's a liquidation liquidation is suppose you have a check you just went to the bank took the money just liquidated the check that means the amount of cash was in a given paper when you have taken the cash out of the paper that's called the liquidation of money management control the management control would be changed if additional common stock or equity financing is issued for accumulated fund so management would not want to increase their common stock as a mode of financing or rather going for debt that would not protect the management control because the creditors have no voice in matters of control this is explained this could be explained in the later lessons of our class as they said creditors have no voice in matter of control because the creditors are who we are the creditors we took the money from them we do not have our control or whatever we want to if they possesses some kind of interest or any kinds of risk on us it's on us because we are taking a huge amount of loan from them if the debt or equity is totally just on us the uh, tax payers or sorry the tax payer the fund givers the banks and the other institution which are giving us the fund we cannot say in place of them so that's in one term that's uh, so in all word that's a long term financing today we got the concept of long term financing and the few of the features or features uh, require those advantages and disadvantages these are included also in the features as i mentioned so lastly if you could have any kinds of question or comments regarding this class please let us know down in the comment box below and be with gurukul thank you